Hello students. In our previous class, we discussed about budget expenditure. That means revenue expenditure and capital expenditure. Today, let's discuss about plan and non-plan expenditure. Means, what's the difference between plan expenditure and non-plan expenditure? Okay. Plan expenditure we mean it is expenditure incurred on the programs detailed in current five year plans. Means that what all kinds of expenditures are included or mentioned in the five year plans of the country, all those expenses are plan expenditure. Means it is clearly mentioned about the expenditure in plans and the approval also taken for the uh, spending of that money clear so all such expenses for example expenditure on agriculture expenditure on industry expenditure on the diff different uh, aspects of the country or different uh, areas of the country all these are coming under this plan expenditure or in other term we can say uh, all the projects covered under central plan in order to obtain development government draft plan clearly so all the expenses are considered as to be this uh, plan expenditure and the same way uh, all the state governments and union territories uh, plans also everything central assistance towards the state also it's considered as to be the uh, plan expenditure normal uh, for the smooth running of the government and other administrative purpose central government supports the state governments by providing sufficient developmental fund. All these are considered as to be plan expenditure. Then you may have a doubt. Yes, the same thing, this plan expenditure, we can say in other terms, that's the revenue expenditure or capital expenditure. Is it? Revenue expenditure, we mean the responsibility of the government to spend that money. Salary to the employees, pension to the employees, and other payments compulsorily done by the government towards the welfare of the people. That's a compulsory part. And uh, capital expenditure, we mean it's a construction or creation of assets in the country. So, for example, construction of a road, construction of a metro, construction of an airport. All these things are considered as to be the expenditure or capital expenditure. Because why? It is creating assets in the country. Clear now? So, we can say that both capital expenditure and current expenditure constitutes the plan because it's clearly mentioned in the plan, five-year plan of the nation till 2050. Why it is 2015 that I will discuss after the topic. Clear. So we can see if the government spends money for the construction of uh, roads or the uh, uh, creation of uh, uh, electricity or the uh, irrigation projects, rural development, all the things uh, for the development of science and technology in the country, all these are mentioned. If it is mentioned in the plan regarding this expense, we can call it as plan expenditure. Because if it is not mentioned in the plan, it is not pos possible to uh, do the business, uh, development there. So it should be mentioned in the plan, should be approved by the government. Then only the government can spend the money for that purpose. That is a plan expenditure. Let's think about what is non-plan expenditure. Yes, non-plan expenditure we mean all the expenditure uh, other than plan expenditure. If any expenditure is coming, government is meeting any such kinds of uh, expenses other than plan expenditure means not mentioned in the five-year plan. Such expenses are called as non-plan expenditure. So for example, uh, payment of interest, payment for the defense, additional subsidies given by the government, administrative expenses other than mentioned in the plan, all the things are considered as to be non-plan expenditure. Means not specifically mentioned in any of the plans or anything. Uh, suddenly it may happen in the expenses. So all these things, what all kinds of expenses are coming other than plan expenses towards the country that is known as non-plan expenditure. There also capital, is, uh, capital expenditure is there. Uh, then uh, revenue expenditure also there. Because all the things are mentioned, it is there, that's okay. It is not mentioned, that is non-plan expenditure. And in other terms, we can say it is the routine expenses of the government. In addition to this one, government protects the nation from foreign invasion. 
So for the defense purpose, anything is extra is required. It's coming under non-plan expenditure. And for the day-to-day -day protection, internal law and order, for the police department and all, anything is extra we are spending other than mentioned in the plan. That is considered to be non-plan expenditure. Police, uh, judiciary, military purposes, and normal running of the government, anything is extra is required other than the plan expenditure. All those expenses are considered as to be non-plan expenditure. Clear now? One more thing we have to add. But the importance of this plan, non-plan expenditure is now is not there in our country. But as soon as, unless until it is there in our syllabus, we have to discuss about that one. Uh, in the year 2011, Rangarajan committee submitted the, a recommendation regarding the plan and non-plan expenditure of the country. In the year 2015, our government uh, disbanded the planning commission, removed the planning commission and adopted a new scheme, Niti Ayok. Now there is no planning commission. So unless until planning commission is not there, it is relating to the plan expenditure. So planning commission is not there. This topic is not relevant. That is why now government is concerned about revenue expenditure and capital expenditure. But it is there in our syllabus. That's why, that's why we have to discuss about that. One. So instead of planning commission, government has adopted a new commission, new committee. That is Niti Ayog. Niti means uh, national institution for Take, uh, transferring India, National Institution for Transferring India, NITI. -I. That is the uh, substitute for the planning commission. So when planning commission is there, plan expenditure will be there. Planning commission is not there. This topic is not coming in that consideration, is it? From 2015, January onward, there is no planning commission in India. So this topic is not much relevant, but it is there in our syllabus. So we have to discuss about that word. At least you should know. What is the difference between plan expenditure and non-plan expenditure? Hope you enjoyed the class. Tomorrow I'll come with a new topic. Thank you.